check out the Cooler Master V800. I'm gonna do a very short review right now for you guys, because I know a lot of you guys don't have an attention span of three or four minutes. So here's the deal. In this price range, this does not have any competition. Um, there's gonna be nothing that's this efficient at all. So nice clean power. It's built on the Seasonic uh, KM3 platform and the Seasonic platform is you know uber solid a lot of different manufacturers have been using that platform uh, all all japanese capacitors on the inside and um yeah the reviews on this are pretty ridiculous the power delivery is pretty ridiculous and it's almost always around 90 percent efficient so there, there's your quick review now let's get into it and uh really take a closer look at the v850 we're also going to take this apart and look at the insides first off you can see we have a nice Honeycomb mesh here and a 135 millimeter fan there with the Cooler Master logo. In the back here, we also have more honeycomb and you can see the insides there. Rocker switch, plug, fully modular on the other side. And I'm not sure how they were able to do as much as they did. They did fully modular and, you know, they've used the Seatonic platform, good, good capacitors. Uh, they've rated this at 40 degrees Celsius operating temperature, but you should be able to go, I don't know, 45 or 46, 47, who knows, maybe even 50 with this. It should be just fine. So. They've been very conservative as far as that goes. It's 80 plus gold. And let's, um, let's talk about the different, well, let's actually, let's talk about the dimensions first. It's 150 by 170 by 86 millimeters. And in inches, that's 5.9 by 6.7 by 3.4. It's a pretty standard size. Let's look at all these cables. You get a yeah, 20 plus four pin connector. Uh, you get two of the four plus four pin. That's the eight pin uh, motherboard power connector. You get two of those. Uh, you get, six of the six plus two pin PCI Express power connectors, nine SATA power connectors, and uh, you get four of the four pin peripheral connectors like the Molex, and then you get uh, one four pin floppy. So you got a lot of options there. I like the fact that we have two of the eight pin 12 volt power supply or you know power motherboard power thing connectors. Those are pretty cool. Um, now let's talk about the different efficiencies and then we're gonna pull this thing apart and really take a good look at it. Now, at everything up to about 750 watts, it hovers around and sometimes it gets up to 91%. So it's like really efficient uh, all the way up to 750. And then even at max load, it is 88% efficient, earning it a very, you know, very good gold rating. You know, that's easy. That's gold, yeah. Do it, gold, all day. So that's really cool. Um, let's take it apart. Take a look on the inside. As you can see there, there's that uh, nice Seasonic platform used to power a lot of the other similar power supplies from different vendors. Um, this one, they've done a hell of a job. The soldering is really clean, like mine hurting, I, I don't know who, I think I think each one of these must have been done by like Solder Master. I think Solder Master Steve. Now, if you look at the capacitors, you'll notice they're all uh, Nippon Kimikon capacitors, except you have a few Hitachi uh, capacitors on the main filters, but everything in there is Japanese, all uh, high quality capacitors. So uh, that's good as well. So the bottom line here really is that you're going to be extremely hard pressed to find any competition for this in this price range, unless some of the others go on sale, like Seasonic has a really good one, uh, like the Corsair RM850, now that they fixed a few of the, the minor problems I have with that, that's also a very good one. But again, this is a, you know lower cost and better than most. I mean, it's just a damn good power supply. Click on something. Man, relax and groove. Peace. I hate that. How do people say peace? They really, they really have nothing else that they can say. All right, everybody. See you next time. Peace in the Middle East. Can, do you guys know him? Solder Master Steve. He's training all the Solder Masters. Steve. <laughs>